Okay, okay, welcome to the bank. 16 miles, 25 minutes, 315 watt hours per mile. As usual, it's interesting. Um, just shortly after leaving Lago Vista, came across a couple of white Cadillac SUVs. Uh, the first one, he was he was in the outside lane, I'm on the inside lane, but FSD and, and me can see that he's kind of drifting over the white line separating our lanes. I was going, wait, I don't want to be next to that guy. And when I get when I get closer, I see, oh, he has a crumpled white fender on the driver's side, on the front. Yeah, maybe maybe he's trying to get in an accident. Possibly. What's really odd is not too far up in front of him is another white Cadillac. This one, the back end is crumpled. Oh my goodness. Says a lot for Cadillacs, doesn't it? Anyway, whatever, peace and harmony. Um, everything is run, it runs pretty smooth day. I mean, there is those people, those people, just like with my Porsche, my old Porsche, you know, oh, I don't want to be passed by a Tesla. Oh no, I'm faster than him. Oh yeah. If you were that fast before, you would have been going that fast before. I wouldn't be catching up to you. I passed you because you're going slow. Whatever, peace and harmony. All right, so pulling into the bank. I mean, navigation says he has it nailed. Uh, as soon as soon as he gets to the turn, all of a sudden, though you can feel the wheels jerk left like he wants to go straight. Brake on us off immediately. I mean, I have cars behind me. I don't have time to play. Either you have it or you don't. So in this case, he didn't. But everything else was pretty good. Yes, the Highland Lake stop sign, we, we grabbed it. Whatever. Okay, welcome to 24 hour, 12 miles, 19 minutes, 264 watt hours per mile. Um, I didn't reset the trip, so I don't know. But since last charge, 28 miles, okay, 8 kilowatt hours. Anyway, whatever. Um, pull, pulling out of um, the bank, no problems. Um, you could argue that I didn't stop, and yes, I didn't stop because the light was red. I just rolled. Um, as we get closer to uh, Bell, man, these people are moving so slow. Uh, I'm actually behind the school bus. So thinking that the school bus is what's slowing me down, I move to the inside lane, and what do I find? The school bus actually is keeping up with the cars in front of them. Wait, no, school buses don't do that. Do they? No. So that's the kind of surprise. So I'm stacked up behind. Uh, there's all these cars and just no place to go today. I mean, they're on the highways. They're they're moving forward, but they're driving like, hey, if it takes all day to get there, that's okay. <gasps> oh, God help me. Okay, whatever. So I've actually had three interruptions on this segment. And all three were because of of me wanting to jam car in where FSD doesn't want to because he doesn't like it. Okay, so whatever. I mean, this is the way it is. So the last FSD uh, interruption, I'd slipped it off. But other than that, FSD had absolutely no problems. Wow. I'm astounded. Astounded. But we'll see how it goes. Okay, 28 miles, 45 minutes, 242 watt hours per mile. Um, although I'll admit that over half of, well, let's say at least half of the trip this afternoon has been without FSD. Um, FSD, when we're up on uh, US 183, a couple of times he wanted to switch lanes and I flicked the turn signal off because I didn't want to switch lanes. I mean, could it could it possibly work out? Yeah, maybe. But why? Why are, why are you doing this? Because I'm California Road Ranger. Yes, that's the only reason to do it. Uh, last time I let you do it in this situation, I ended up taking the toll road in the, uh, down to 1431. Not that it's only a few miles. But anyway, uh, so navigation is picked to go down Lake Line today. 
Um, let's see, was FSD off? I think FSD was off. So I turned off FSD because I was getting tired of, I need to go in the middle lane. No, you don't. And I know when we get down to the bottom of the exit at, at the uh, Lakeline Mall uh, Drive, I think it is, that he's going to want to switch to the middle lane, which takes you away from making a left turn onto Lakeline Boulevard. It, it just doesn't make any sense. But that's FSD for you. Um, so anyway, uh, FSD off. I'm, cru I'm cruising along. Um, I see that the... No, uh, what? I guess I felt like the inside lane looked like it was going to open up just a little bit. And as, as I get over, the, there's a guy who's in the outside of the two turn lanes. And he's going like, oh, wait, oh, I need to get over. Whoa, slam on the brakes. And sure enough, once we made the turn, he, he goes back to the outside lane, the inside lane. Eventually, there, there was a car who was going slow for a little ways. He eventually made a left turn. Boom, bam, gone. Now, there was a black ram. That black, there was a black ram that hung around the car all the way down to Loman Fort. Wow. Anyway, whatever. Peace and, har peace and harmony. It's all good. Um... So anyway, the part 183, other, other than I didn't want to switch lanes and FSD, but I want to. So, I mean, but most of that was good. Okay. Um, I actually went through all of Lake Line Boulevard without FSD on just because I could see there's a, there's a mix of a lot of slow people and some of the slow people are just they're going. They're eventually going to turn left, and they just think we should all wait for them to get there. And then there's the other mix of, what? I'm driving a car. What do you mean I'm driving a car? Uh, hey, hey, Nitza. Nitza, are you are you out there? Hey, maybe you should do something about the people who aren't able to stay in their lanes. No, I'm not talking about FSD. FSD does a great job of lane keeping. Even autopilot does a good job at lane keeping. So that's not the problem. And and actually we have warning systems. Like if you get over on the white line, the, 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 depending on how you have it set, mine's set to rumble. So my wheel will rumble. So I have safety systems keep me in the middle of the lane. Maybe you ought to focus on the other 70, 80 million cars that don't have these kind of safety features built into them. How's that for an idea? Instead of focusing on the, the what, 10 accidents where, oh, I was running FSD. That's why it was beating. Well, I mean, is that possible? Yes. Chances are that's not the real cause. Right? They're just not owning up to their actions. Okay, whatever. Um, so we, we get it. We finally, I go to the outside of the two left turns on 1431. Turn left to re-invoke FSD. Actually, first, since I'm the first one lying, yes, I enjoy a little acceleration. You betcha. Let all those people behind me who go like, Oh, I go really fast see what a moderate pace is in a Tesla. That's just moderate pace. Didn't, didn't hardly have to try. Now, kind of made the guy next to me mad because he comes up, he barely gets in front of me, and then, oh, what's that? He's going to turn right. He could have made that right turn from behind me, but he just had to prove that Oh, I got there before the Tesla. Well, that's because I was going to speed limit. Right? That, that's that's how you manage that. But oh, whatever. Peace and army. Um, so, like, I don't know if I said it already, but today is a day of slow people. I, I don't know. What is going on? 
right? We're, we're in a 55 zone going down the hill. Two people typically speed down that hill. And, and again, I'm in the inside lane. I got two pickups in front of me, and they're doing the same thing they did yesterday or the other day. Oh, well, uh, I heard to give out tickets, and so I, I think I better go 50 here. Well, you just went by a Travis County deputy. So if he was going to give out tickets down the hill, he would have been down the hill. He was up the he was up on the flat. So he's not there to give out tickets. In the meantime, everybody around you is waiting for you to go. Now eventually they did go. Okay. And eventually FS, I, I got back to the outside lane just about the time oh, all of a sudden we come into a stop. Okay, not a stop, stop, but we're slowing down significantly, like four, down to 40. Oh my goodness gracious. Not FST's fault. I mean, I'm the one who wanted to switch. But, oh, come on. Whatever. It, it, it's just one of those days. It, 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 it just is. You know, you know it, 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 it's, it's just a mixed up mess of junk. Okay. So coming up on the magical Tesla traffic light. Is that where I am? Uh, for some reason, I'm behind a, a relatively slow moving vehicle. I, I don't think they quite know how where they're going. Okay. Uh, there's a car coming up next to me. So he, he's already starting to overlap. FSD gets the brilliant idea that we should switch lanes to go faster. Yes. The car shows up in the turn signal, red stripe. Guess what the grade is today? Yes, it's a D. Come on, come on. Who who in FSD land made this magical change? I mean, it's since I got 11.4.9. I mean, really? What, what is going, why? Why are you wanting to switch lane? Now, to be fair to, to Tesla, he is as he has occasionally wanted to do this previously, just the there was enough room for a New York City driver. In this case, no, we're overlapping. Or they're right next to me. It's obvious it's not safe to switch lanes. And you get the red stripe from this from the safety system. If only Tesla could talk to Tesla. I mean, what is going on here? Okay, whatever. It, it's just one of those days. Um, so, that break on FSD off. Message sent. After you get to the top of this little hill, FSD back on. Or actually, I switched to the inside lane after the car that's next to me figures out how he's going to go. Because he's also going, wait, oh, what, what am I doing here? Uh, you're driving down a highway. Act like it. You know, whatever. So, coming up on Destination Way, you, if you've heard me talk, you know exactly what FSD's thinking. And I was waiting to see it split, switch. At first, he's going, oh, no, I know what I'm doing. I know what I'm doing. And then all of a sudden, whoop, yeah, there goes the noodle. It's into the turn lane. Brake on FC off. FC off the rest of, off the, rest of the trip. There you go. So we end up with a D, and the D is because, for some reason, you can't avoid. You can't. You can't help yourself. Look, there's a car there, and I want to go faster. The best way to do it is to cut off another car and get in an accident with it. No. The fastest way to get home is to stay out of an accident. Get in an accident doesn't get you home faster. Whatever. It's a D. There you go.